What is going on guys, Fitcher here and I am back. Now today I just want to have a little bit of a chat with you guys about where I've been, what's been going on, what's going to be happening in the future with the channel and I've also got a big ASR announcement that I want to make. I know what you're all wondering, where the hell have I been? It's been like three weeks or something since I last uploaded a video, which is quite a long time on this channel. And really, it's a pretty simple explanation. The last two weeks, I've had my exams, and the week before that was pretty much flat out revision. So yeah, that's why I couldn't upload videos for the last three weeks. You know, schoolwork has to take priority over YouTube, but my exams are done. Finally, they're all done. They finished on Thursday. Yesterday, I just had to chill out and played Xbox all day. I was playing a bit of P-Cars, which is going to link into the AS our announcement which is a little bit later on but video should resume now I have I think it's Van Dorn Korea Spain already recorded so I'll get into editing that really soon that should be out tomorrow on Sunday then I've got highlights from Australia and Bahrain ASR races they'll come out over the next two days and tomorrow night is ASR China so there will also be some highlights from that race after those and then I'll just be getting back into the Van Dorn, the Van Dorn career and just making videos again. I think the next two weeks I have I guess what they call handback. Well, a week and a half handback because this weekend is cut weekend so it's a four day weekend here in Melbourne which is absolutely brilliant. So the next two weeks are probably a fair few added a fair few videos will probably increase from what the normal amount that I upload during school time is but then it's going to decrease again because before the end of the year before my summer break I have four weeks of next year which is I think is absolute bullshit but the videos are going to back down a bit in two weeks time because I have four weeks of next year which is a bit frustrating. I understand why I do it to some extent, but I think four weeks is ridiculous. I think I have a freaking English sack before the end of the year, which is quite frustrating. But when school finishes, I think my last day is like the 8th of December, around that time. Then I'll be on summer break pretty much until the end of January, the start of February. So there'll be tons and tons of videos over the Australian summer. And I've also got a new series planned for over that summer. It's another career mode, a little bit different. If you follow on that if you follow me on Twitter, you'll probably know what it, what it is. I did actually record the first two episodes of it. I might use those two. I might re-record them. I don't know. But that'll be coming when I get off school at the start of December. Okay, now for the big ASR announcement. We're happy to announce a brand new championship, the V8 Supercar Championship on Project Cars. Of course, it's going to be run on the Xbox One, and we're going to be using the Ford Falcon. I can't remember the name of it, but it's the only V8 Supercar in the game, unfortunately. There is no Holdens, Volvos, Nissan. Unfortunately, they only have the Ford, which is a little disappointing because it's my least favorite out of all of them. But that's the car we're going to be using. I believe it's a free DLC car, so you will need to download that if you want to partake in this championship. Now, races are most likely going to be on a Friday night at the normal start time, which is 8 p.m. Melbourne, Sydney time. So at the moment, that's Australian Eastern Daylight Savings time on a Friday night. It might change to a Saturday night, but most likely on a Friday night. The championship will consist of 12 rounds with three different event formats and will run over 15 weeks. The three event formats are the Super Sprint, which will have two 60K races, the Super GT, which will have one 120K race, and then the Endurance Cup, which includes a 500 kilometer Bathurst race, so it's exactly half the distance of the Bathurst 1000. Now the championship will run weekly except during the Endurance Cup where there'll be a one week break between each race just because the Enduro rounds take so long and we just feel that a it's good to have a week break in between the races. Like the Bathurst 500 we're going to run is probably going to take like three hours or something that races 80 laps around Bathurst, which will take quite a while. Now, as for places, there's only 16 places on the grid because that's all we can hold in a Project Cars lobby. Two are already taken with me and Jason. There could be up to another four already taken by some of our friends. Certainly, there's only about 10 places left, so you need to get quick, get in quick. If you want to partake in this championship, I'll leave a link in the description to the website, and there will be a place on the forums where you have to go and just say you want to sign up, and I'll add you in, and you can team up with one of your friends. We're going to put a limit on two-car teams. There's also going to be a teams championship. Also, you're going to have to select a livery from the Project Cars liveries. The 42 and the 43 are already taken because that's what me and Jason are going to be running. But there's a fair few other liveries for you to choose. There's also a few other sort of teams, like there's a 2 and a 22, which are the same team, for example. So if you're a big HRT fan and you want to partake in this championship with one of your friends, 
that's the car for you. But like I said, if you want to sign up, the link will be in the description of this video. And yeah, I can't wait to get into this. We'll start it pretty much once we've got enough numbers, once we feel we've got enough numbers. So there's no set start time. Of course, there'll also be that two week break over Christmas, New Year, like we're going to be running in the F1 Championship. But that is pretty much it for today's video. I hope you guys did enjoy it, cleared some stuff up as to what's happening, what's happening in the future. And I hope to see you all getting involved with this V8 Supercar Championship. Of course, I'll be uploading the highlights of each race onto this channel, the same as I'm doing with the F1 League. But yeah, that's all for today. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, make sure to smash that like button. If you are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Oh, and thank you guys so much for 650 subscribers and over 100,000 video views. It's absolutely crazy, and I just can't thank you guys enough for the support recently, especially since the launch of F1 2016.